I remember meeting Sam Allardyce for the first time was when I signed as an eight-year-old. He came and like welcomed us all to the club. I just remember shaking his hand, and his hand being the biggest hand I've ever shaken. And I was just like, I lost my hand. I was like, Where, where's my hand gone? But that's memory, first memory of Sam Allardyce. It seemed like you played one game on loan at Berry, mm -hmm. then you had one season at Bolton, and then you're being scouted and eventually signed by Arsenal. It seemed incredibly quick. Is that yeah. how it was? It literally was. The the whole Berry loan was just to be around a first team environment, a first team changing rooms, how to act in front of senior pros. And then it just prepared me for coming back the new season with Bolton. And I was straight up with the, with the team and playing. And then I sort of dropped out of the team and had to go back to 21s. Back sort of working hard, tra training, and then broke into the team and then had the run to the whole end of the end of the season. Playing right back was the only way I was getting in the team and I was just like, yeah, play, I'll play right back, just get me in. And um, it was away at Forest. I think David Wheater went off with a slight like, hamstring and I had to move to centre half and then it was like centre half, back at home, natural, feel, feel comfortable there. Do you remember then when you first got pulled to one side and someone said, Arsenal Wenger quite likes your Arsenal? It was um, Dave Lee, who was my 18s coach. He pulled me and just said, oh, Steve Bolds. In, and I didn't even know Steve Pope was like, that's how <laughs> ignorant of me, I, I didn't know who it was. And did, was you, did you say that or did you no, bluff I was it? Like, oh, I was great. like to my dad, I was like, he said like Steve Bowles watching, my dad's like, Steve Bowles is that Arsenal centre half legend. <laughs> I'm thinking, oh, I'm sorry, I don't know, <laughs> dad didn't know. But um, he said he was in the stand and he was talking to him and they really liking the look of you and they're watching you. And it was um, our last game of the season on the coach down to Fulham. And the, assist, the manager at the time, who was Jimmy Phillips, was caretaker manager. He, he just pulled me and just said, I've had a phone call off the chairman, I can't play you. They don't want you getting injured in the last game of the season, so you're not playing. And I was like, this is crazy. When I first came to Arsenal, I was called up. I mean, it was um, Liverpool at home, first game of the season. I was thinking, I'd never been to the Emirates before. And then I was walking out in front of 60,000, like, season opener. That was opener. your first day you'd never That was the even... first day I'd been to the, been to the Emirates. And I was just like walking around the stadium, full crowds, I was thinking, is this like, is this, is this it? Is this the best it gets? <laughs> like, does it get any better than this? The form you're in at the moment, is this your best run in an Arsenal shirt? Yeah, I'd have to agree. I think consistency wise, I think it's been sort of 10, 10, 11 games, consistently playing and playing to a good level, not just playing because someone's injured and you're, you're there on merit. And I think that has been, that gives you more confidence. And it is, a, it is a, the best run I've been on since I've been at the club.